Recent studies have said that American men are thinking more about the Roman Empire than they think about sex. It must be true. It's trending on social media. We are obsessing about the Romans, what they created, what life must have been like back then, and where their society went. And the thinking is that we're pondering the Roman society because we're wondering about our own society. What have we created? What have we left behind in the past? And where is our society going? Two great kingdoms. But you know, our work is not of this world. In fact, Jesus, who was a member of the literal Roman Empire, turned the kingdom upside down. He said that the first will be last. He ensured that the meek rose. He gave sight to the blind. And of himself, he said, I did not come to be served, but to serve and to give my life as a ransom for many. It's an incredible challenge that we get to continue today, gentlemen, in a world that desperately is looking for love. We have the opportunity to ensure a seat at the table for the last, that the meek are well taken care of, and that the imprisoned are set free in spirit. I guess it's, uh, I guess I got my uh, Halloween costume. Halloween isn't for XXX one days away. Uh, Yeah, that was a Roman numeral joke. Kingdoms do fall, but the reign of God does not. And we get to be today the literal hands and feet of that reign. Let's obsess about that.